I spend a lot of time at the market stall so I can learn the merchant's trade. My job is to serve the yard. I don't really know anyone at the college. I guess everyone just assumes I do because I'm a Dunman. Unless you're bringing me Mages don't round, let us go in the college. They said it's not safe in there. Was there something else? I suppose it would be inappropriate of me to ask how you obtained this, so I simply won't. A rubbing, eh? Odd. I expected notes. I understand. Now, let me take a good look at this. Over here, please. Hmm, this is intriguing, but highly disturbing. It appears that Gallus had suspicions about Mercer Frey's allegiance to the Guild for months. Gallus had begun to uncover what he calls an unduly lavish lifestyle replete with spending vast amounts of gold on personal pleasures. Does the journal say where this wealth came from? Yes, Gallus seems certain that Mercer had been removing funds from the Guild's treasury without anyone's knowledge. Anything else, Enther? Anything about... the Nightingales? Yes, here it is. The last few... Pages seem to describe the failure of the Nightingales, although it doesn't go into great detail. Gallus also repeatedly mentions his strong belief that Mercer desecrated something known as the Twilight Sepulchre. Shadows preserve us, so it's true. I, I'm not familiar with the Twilight Sepulchre. What is it? What's, what's Mercer Frey done? I'm sorry, Enther. I can't say. All that matters is we deliver your translation to the Guild immediately. Farewell, Enther. Words can't express. It's all right, Carlia. You don't have to say a word. Hmm? Mercer lied to the Guild, branded me a murderer and slandered my name across his network of contacts. For 25 years I ran, never sleeping in the same place twice and carefully covering my tracks. Mercer doesn't need to die. He needs to feel the cold sting of fate as his life crumbles in front of him and he's hunted by the Guild. 
I can promise you if it comes to that, and my back's to the wall, I won't hesitate. Listen, all I want is the truth to be revealed to the guild. If you ever manage to gain entry to the college and you find trying to rid yourself of stolen goods becoming a burden, come visit me. I've been known to handle items of questionable interest from time to time, and I'll see what I can do. If you have further need of me, you can find me in the college. We must hasten to Riften before Mercer can do any more damage to the guild. You've come this far. So I see no harm in concealing it any longer. The Twilight Sepulchre is the temple to Nocturnal. It's what the Nightingales are sworn to protect with their lives. Everything that represents Nocturnal's influence is contained within the walls of the Sepulchre. Now it seems Mercer's broken his oath with Nocturnal, and defiled the very thing he swore to protect. I felt the same way when Gallus first revealed these things to me. I think given time you'll understand what I mean. As a Nightingale, I've been sworn to secrecy regarding the Sepulchre. I know the Guild doesn't do much to foster faith, but I'm going to have to ask that you continue to trust me. I'll make for Riften and scout the situation, see if I can discover what Mercer's up to. When you're ready, meet me at the Ragged Flagon. In the meantime, I wanted you to have this. It belonged to Gallus, but... Given the circumstances, I think he'd approve. If the Guild isn't willing to listen to reason, you might have to. Taking me up on my offer, eh? Good. The mages don't let us go into college. They said it's not safe in there. Find your wolfish grin unsettling. Had another run in with the Thief's Guild. Be careful, Milo. The Thieves Guild has Maven Blackbriar at her back. One snap of her fingers, and you could end up in Riften jail. Or worse. They represent the reason I'm here. I can't just ignore them, Eren. I know. I just don't want you to leave. You're the only good thing that's happened to this city in a long time. If you're looking for a handout, you want to speak with my husband. If you're looking for company, I suppose I could do worse. New in town, eh? Here for the fishing, I guess. Voli's around somewhere, planning to feed the poor with his nonsense about Mara. Aha, a fellow Nord. I trust you're bringing the fight to the Empire? There's nothing like fishing on Lake Andre. You should try it sometime. I presume you're bothering me for a good reason.
glad you're here. I think some of these people are beginning to suspect who I am. Are you ready to face the guild? Keep your eyes open. I'm not sure what to expect when we enter the system. Better have a damn good reason to be here with that murderer. Please, lower your weapon so we can speak. I have proof that you've all been misled. No tricks, Carlia, or I'll cut you down where you stand. Now what's this so-called proof you speak of? I have Gallus's journal. I think you'll find its contents disturbing. Let me see. No, it, it can't be. This can't be true. I've known Mercer too long. It's true, Brynjolf. Every word. Mercer's been stealing from the guild for years, right under your noses. There's only one way to find out if what the last says is true. Delvin, I'll need you to open the vault. Wait like just a blessed moment, Bryn. What's in that book? What did it say? It says Mercer's been stealing from a vault for years. Gallus was looking into it before he was murdered. Now can Mercer open up a vault with me? Two keys. It's impossible. Could he pick his way in? That door has the best puzzle locks money can buy. There's no way it can be picked open. You didn't need to pick the lock. What's she on about? Use your key on the vault, Delvin. We'll open it up and find out the truth. Still locked up tighter than a drum. Now use yours. Ninety-eight. It's gone. Everything's gone. Get in here, all of you. The dog. The jewels. It's all gone. Son of a bitch! I'll kill him! Vex, put it away. Right now. We can't afford to lose our heads. We need to calm down and focus. Do what he says, Vex. This ain't helping right there. Fine. We do it your way. For now. Delvin, Vex, watch the flagon. If you see Mercer, come tell me right away. Look. Before I help you track Mercer down, I need to know what you learned from Carlia. I mean, everything. I... I feared that was the case. From that last entry in Gallus' diary, it looks like he was getting close to exposing Mercer to the guild. Anything else? Nightingales. But I always assumed they were just a tail. A way to keep the young footpads in line. Was there anything else she told you? Trying to make Mercer look bad in front of Maven, eh? Clever lass. Was there anything else? Then I have an important task for you. I need you to break into Mercer's home and search for anything that could tell us where he's gone. Aye. A gift from the Black Briars after they kicked the previous family out. A place called Rift Wheeled Manor. He never stays there, just pays for the upkeep on it. Hired some lout by the name of Bold to guard the place. Be careful, lad. This is the last place in Skyrim I'd ever want to send you. 
Just find a way in, get the information and leave. And you have permission to kill anyone that stands in your way. Good question. I've only set foot inside a few times myself, and that was in Mercer's company. If you can get past his trained watchdog, I think your best bet might be the ramp to the second floor balcony in his backyard. No. It's some sort of crazy contraption Mercer commissioned for quick escapes. I'd wager a well-placed shot at the ramp's mechanism would lower it in a hurry. That'd be Vault. A real piece of work, that one. Mercer's holding something over his head, keeping him loyal. Talk to Vex. She used to know him very well, if you catch my meaning. Better question would be, what did he leave? Mercer took everything. Even all of our plans are gone. Before Mercer took over, Gala started collecting every bit of material he could on locations the guild could heist. Museums, keeps, estates, you name it. By the time Mercer took over the guild, we must have had a few dozen. I don't have a clue. That door is impenetrable. Without two keys, it's impossible to open. I have a key. Delvin has a key, and Mercer has a key. That's it. There are no other copies. Careful at Mercer's place. I don't want to lose anyone else to that madman. I can't believe this is happening, lad. I can't believe he emptied the vault right from under our noses. I dare Mercer to come back here. Set one foot in the cistern and I'll cut it off. Better leave a piece of Mercer for us. It's payback time. I never saw this coming. I thought we were just having a run of bad luck. I dare Mercer to come back here. Set one foot in the cistern and I'll cut it off. I never saw this coming. I thought we were just having a run of bad luck. How can Carlyle remain so calm when Mercer had her on the run for that long? Amazing. Vex better leave a piece of Mercer for us. It's payback time. I can't believe this is happening, lad. Need to stay focused in case Frey comes back. Make it fast. That pig? Oh, I have info on him. More than you care to know. Vald? Good side? Think you have the wrong person. The only thing Vald understands is gold. A man after my own heart. Sure, but he'll ask for a whole lot. I mean, you are asking him to betray Mercer Frey. Your best bet would be to erase his debt with Maven Blackbriar. If you talk to her, she might be able to give you the details. Of course, you could just run him through and take what you need off his corpse. I could care less. While you're in there, help yourself to anything in Frey's manor. Brid, yo, Faye. Let me guess. He just plucked you off the street, 
and dropped you into the thick of things without telling you which way is up. Am I right? See, that kind of attitude comes from someone who wants to get rich and stay alive long enough to enjoy it. We're going to get along nicely. So, if you've got the nerve, I've got plenty of extra jobs to help get the guild back on its feet. Look around you. The flagon, the guild, it's all falling apart. A few decades ago, this place was as busy as the Imperial City. Now, you'd be lucky if you don't trip over a skeever instead. Look, I know the others think I'm a bit dull for saying stuff like this, but I'm gonna give it you straight. Something out there is piss drunk mad at us. I don't know who or what it is, but it's beyond just you and me. We've been cursed. I'll tell you what we do. We spit in that curse's face and turn things around down here. Put things back the way they were. That's where you come in. I've got plenty of work available that could guide us down the road to recovery. All you need to do is ask, and we can both come out of this smelling like a rose. Well, well. I was looking for this little beauty. If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, be sure to bring them to me. I promise it'll be worth the effort. What a delightful find. This should cover it. This is getting dangerous. Don't let anything get a jump on you. emptied the vault. I can't believe he emptied the vault. Right from under our nose. Come to see Balaman perform miracles with steel, eh? I've never seen me all this upset about anything. The city really gets to hurt. What brings you to Balamut today? Repair? Purchase?
This is Mercer Frey's place, and he don't like visitors. Now go. No visitors. No way. Now piss off before you make me mad. You ain't got enough coin to make my problems go away. Unless you can talk to Maven Blackbriar into letting me out of my debt. You try and set one foot in this yard and I'll cut it off. Oh, come on, I ain't that dumb. All right, then. Until next time. <laughs>